So I think we're about ready to begin depositions here on March 30, 3rd, 2022. If Ms. Nugent, if you could just slide down just a little bit because my head's kind of cut off. To the right? Yes, ma'am. Okie doke. Okay, will you raise your right hand, please, ma'am? Do you solemnly swear or affirm that the testimony you're about to give shall be the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth? I do. Thank you. Yes, hi, good morning. My name, uh, you know my name. Uh, could you please state and spell your name for the record? Linda Nugent, L-I-N-D-A-N-U-G-E-N-T. And what occupation are you, Ms. Nugent? I'm a county probation officer. And do you specialize in misdemeanor cases? Yes. And at the time of July 1st, 2020, uh, were you a probation officer? Yes. And the defendant, Levi Jonathan, was he one of your clients? Yes, you were on probation with me. And what was the case? Do you remember? I believe it may have been trespass and charge. And was the defendant sentenced to 180 days in jail plus 12 months probation? I don't recall how many days in jail or if there was jail time, but I do know that you were on probation for 12 months. All right, so you don't recall that the defendant did any jail time? I don't recall the detail. Right. Do you recall a court um, hearing in which you were present uh, to verify that the defendant had um, actually done jail time? Complete the jail sentence? No, I don't. Judge Grody? No, I don't. Mm -hmm. And do you recall if the defendant had appealed that case? I do recall there was an appeal, yes. And was the defendant given early termination? No. Did the defendant pay his fines and court costs up front? I wouldn't know. That's not a condition of probation. And is it usual that if somebody pays a court cost and fines up front and does their time, um, that they're able to get early termination after 50, completing 50% 50 of their time, if they file the, the necessary motion? And what was that question again? Well, is there a rule that states that people are able to get 50 uh, early termination if they completed 50% of their time and paid fines and court costs. No, there's no rule. There's no rule that, that states that a person can't get early termination? There's no rule stating that a person can be early termed after they do half of their probation time. Excuse me? There's no rule that a person can early terminate probation after they completed half of their probation period. There is isn't. Possible. It's possible, yes. And would that be something that would be determined by a judge? The judge, of course. You know, they terminate jurisdiction. And what's the process of that? You guys know how hot it is in here? I feel like it's 100 degrees in here. Do you have air conditioning or a fan or something? Is it hot? Or is it just me? I, I feel quite comfortable, to be honest with you. Oh. And what was your question? My question is, um, is a person able to get early termination if they pay the fines and court costs and serve their jail time? That's up to the judge. And is there a hearing that goes with that? It depends on the judge. Now, would that appeal, would an appeal affect that process? It, I assume it could. Do you recall telling the defendant because he appealed, he was not able to get early termination? No, I don't. I don't mean to cut you off at this point, but I don't see how this is relevant to our case and why we're here for deposition today. So I would ask you to move along in your questioning to a point where this is relevant in some way to our case. Sir, we allege conspiracy. And I'm gathering the evidence to prove this. Now, 
Do you recall the conversation with the defendant in which the defendant asked you directly about the comment you made regarding early termination and the appeal? No. Do you recall telling the defendant that you were confused and thought that were thinking about an entirely different case when you made the statement that the defendant was unable to get early termination because he had appealed? No, I don't recall that. I have no more questions. I have no questions for this witness. Would you like to read her away? Uh, no. Wait. I'll wait, yes. All right. Thank you, Ms. Nugent. You're pretty good. You're welcome. God bless you, Ms. Nugent. Would you like Officer Francisco or Ms. Hayes? Those are the next two witnesses. I would like to take uh, Kendria Hill, please. She's outside. I'm ready for her. Okay. Um, sir, if I may, um, can I go out and get a towel or something because I'm sweating and I think it's too hot in here and I don't think that's a coincidence. Could I please go out and get a towel? You need to use the bathroom? Yeah. Okay. 